If you, if you harness the computers in your life to, to capture that longitudinal data, um, then you, you, can, you can discover incredible things about yourself. But then when we add the ability to share, you see, mm -hmm. you, you don't really own something if you can't play with it, if you can't share it. Yes. So when you own your own data, then you can make an informed decision. Like, I'm actually going to contribute some of this data um, for longitudinal studies um, against an entire population groups. That is, is the curiosity that I'm pursuing right now. Um, you know, how does the world sleep? How are... Um, GLP-1 agonists affecting behaviors beyond just um, you know, weight loss? How has you know, COVID affected people long term? If, if you can reach back and, and, and pick up some of these tiny little bits of detail, right, which, which are buried in your step count, it's buried in a mm -hmm. bunch of trivialities, but um, they can be de-siloed and then aggregated then we can find the hidden patterns that show causal relationships that are today just mysteries. And I'm, I'm really excited about that. Like, there, there's a tremendous amount of value to unlock there that just comes from picking up all of these threads.